Wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. It's Momna from Momna's Life. So in today's video, I just want to talk about some contact lenses that I've recently ordered. I've only previously made a video about contact lenses once, and that was when I purchased Solitica colored hydrocore contacts. And I'll leave the link down below. That video was very old. So, <laughs> and I think in the video I had dropped my contact on the floor. It was a mess. Anyway, today that's not the case. I ordered some new contact lenses. And the reason I want to wear colored contacts is not because I'm not happy with my brown eyes, but it's just sometimes you get so tired of like always looking the same. So I think it's kind of fun to kind of change up your look. And one way you could do that is obviously contact lenses. But in the past, I wore like really bright colors and it just did not suit me so well. But I thought, you know, it's been a long time since I wore color contacts. I only wear my clear contacts now so I could see because I'm like completely blind without my glasses. And I just refuse to wear glasses. But um, <laughs> I was scrolling through Instagram and for some odd reason, contact lenses were in one of the ads. And I was just like really curious. I was like, you know what? I haven't changed. I haven't purchased um, colored contacts in such a long time. It'd be really fun to see what I look like in like a more natural color. So as you guys can see from the title of the video, um, I don't know if you guys have heard of this brand before. This is my first time hearing about them. They're called Dimple, Dimple Color or something. I'll double check the name of the company, but they're called Dimple Contacts, Dimple Color. And honestly, on Instagram, you know a lot of companies don't seem legit but just seeing the quality of their page and going through their website it just seemed like a legit place to buy contacts and now the color that i bought was heavenly hazel now i was looking for a very subtle almost close to a brownie hazel color eyes so that it doesn't look like pop in your face like uh, like i'm wearing contacts but like more like hmm are those her eyes <gasps> they're so nice like don't even think i'm wearing contacts almost so i just wanted something to look very natural and almost enhance my eyes already because your girl is getting tired <laughs> i actually bought some makeup too and this video won't be about makeup but um i i initially don't wear foundation just because i've never been able to find the right color i've always wanted to know how to do makeup like in the way where people do it on instagram they just look so nice and like that almost no makeup makeup look like with the foundation but um i spoke to some colleague not too long ago and they said they use a bb cream so i was like you know what let me try bb cream because um her skin looked freaking fl flawless her skin looks flawless and it didn't even look like that person was wearing anything to begin with i just thought it was her natural skin which you know bb cream is very light so it probably was mostly her natural skin with a little bit of enhancing so i'm gonna be trying this and for my girls that don't really like wearing foundation for the most part just want like a little bit more of an enhanced look i'm gonna let you guys know how i like this i haven't tried it yet i'm kind of scared to put it <laughs> on my face but we'll try this and see if it makes us look more i don't know like alive awake more makeup and no makeup look for like when you go to weddings or parties or something but back to the video and i did get the um medical eye contact lenses so it has my prescription so this company does allow for prescription contacts and um this is the packaging this is like some of the cutest contact lens package packaging i've ever received like this is amazing we're living in the most aesthetic um culture lifestyle everything so I'm gonna go ahead and unpack these for you and I'm gonna try them on. And let me just, um, I'm gonna go to my room and try them on because right here I don't really have a table and nowhere really to set it up and put them on. But um, let me show you guys right now. This is my eyes, natural. And like, we're gonna head to my room and we're gonna go ahead and try on the contacts. Now, initially the packaging here does say not to wear the contacts until you let them rest for about four to six hours. But like, I never do that anyway to begin with. So we're just gonna go ahead and put the contacts on. So let's go. Don't do this at home, obviously. I'm doing this at my own risk. I've been wearing contacts for a very long time. And every time I get new contacts, I literally just pop them on when I need to without waiting the four to six hours. So yeah, just to try them on. I'll take them off right away after seeing if I like them. So come on, let's go to the room, guys. All right, guys, we're in my room and um, I went ahead and washed my hands, of course, because you don't want to wear contacts, obviously, until you wash your hands. I'm not that crazy. But <laughs> so like I said, I'm in my room now and I had to just like get ready for this. I'm going to go ahead and take off my contacts that I'm wearing right now. And the company, obviously, they give you such a cute little um, container to hold your contacts. Now I have two containers and obviously do three on between my clear contacts and my color contacts. You guys, 
you guys i have such like high hopes for this because like i've always been wanting to wear like natural looking contact lenses i'm gonna go ahead and use my contact solution and just fill it up while i open packaging but like i really i really hope these contacts look good i'm really excited and it's always fun to find um a great contact company you know i always use solitica but recently i haven't been able to find any contacts on their website plus their contacts are beautiful but they do pop out a lot I don't remember which eye is what um, medicine. One is 170, one is minus one. One of my eyes is minus 175 and the other one's minus 225. I hate that they're different, but I, I have my contacts here. So I'll just double check before I put those in the packaging. My right eye, my right eye is minus 175. <laughs> Do you guys ever just make sure like where your heart is to make sure like it's the right side for your eyes? Cause like, I really don't want to mess that up. Yeah, just me. Yeah, imagine. Or like, you know, when you were a kid and you did the Pledge of Allegiance? Like, yeah. So 175, that's my right eye. I'm gonna go ahead and put that in there. But yeah, I'll tell you guys my honest review with these and see if you guys wanna purchase them as well. <sighs> Initially, I wasn't really gonna make a video about this, but I feel like contacts, color contacts are so tricky. Some companies just have like, like I was saying, Solitica, theirs are beautiful, but they just like pop out so much that like, they definitely look like contacts and i don't want to look scary when i'm wearing contacts i just want to look like natural so i got it open and we're gonna just pull this baby out to my right eye and already looking at it it looks very subtle i don't know if you guys can see that but yeah um let me go ahead and pop this baby open these are always so annoying to open by the way people who wear contacts you know what i mean Especially the colored ones like look if you don't get this right you look like messed up i have to get like my nail clipper to kind of oh man oh i suck at this hopefully i could get the second one but um let's go ahead try to open this with the nail clipper oh shucks i suck at this i like suck maybe i shouldn't use a nail clipper maybe i should use like a, a tweezer omg I didn't take off my actual contacts. Oh, good thing I didn't. I will be so blind. So, so blind. Like, my vision could be a lot worse. I know, like, my sister, her vision is so bad. Like, without her contact, I mean, without, yeah, without her contacts or without her glasses, she cannot see anything or anybody. Like, if a pole was in front of her, she would probably crash into it. I'm not that blind, but, like, if you're sitting across from me, unless, like, I know your body structure, and like the way you walk, I probably wouldn't recognize you on the streets. Like, you guys ever pass somebody by and they're like, I don't see you. No, no, you ever pass somebody by and they're like, hey, you know, I kind of saw you on the street yesterday. And you like looked at me like you didn't even know who I was. And it's kind of like, um, I wasn't wearing my glasses or my contacts. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to ignore you. I just really couldn't see you. And then people are like, yeah, sure. But like, for real, like people who wear glasses, y'all know like my fiance he don't understand he has 20 20 vision i don't know how he was so blessed oh my god you guys i can't get it open guys give me a second i'm gonna try to open this and i'll come right back we got it we got it oh dear oh dear oh they're actually pretty cute looking so far like they almost look like a honey brown let me see if i can bring this up for you guys so all right, I'm not gonna drop it. <laughs> We're not having a part two of my my old video that I made. Like that was a disaster. I don't know why this is always so stressful. I feel like I'm doing surgery down here. Ooh, and I'm watching this Korean drama right now. I'm actually re-watching this Korean drama. I don't know if you guys watch Korean dramas, but there's this Korean drama called Doctor Romantic, I believe. And chef's kiss. Like, if you guys are into surgery and like blood and like crazy stressful situations with the twist of romance mm. you need to watch that drama it's like it's my second time watching it and i was gonna have my fiance watch it but he's just not too interested at this time so maybe another year when i'm like ready to rewatch it i'll be like babe oh, come on i'm rewatching it just watch it with me but yes we're gonna get the second one open and then i'm gonna give you guys a little close-up on the contacts yeah ow i suck at this oh my god I think it's this way there's like arrows okay okay be harsh pull we did it okay let me stop i should have done that the first time 
Anyway, let me see if I can show you guys how honey brown it is, though. Can you guys see? The camera is always such a hassle. Sorry I'm taking so long. I didn't expect this to be such a hassle, actually. Uh, I forgot what color... I forgot what color contacts are like. The process of the packaging. Like, my Claire contacts, I just whip it open and it's, like, right there. Not like this. Okay, great, you guys. I got the contacts in the container. I'm gonna go ahead and take off my contacts now. For some reason, when I was a kid, I just could not understand how you wear contacts. Like, there's this awkward um phase where like you just cannot get contact into your eyes like i couldn't but like i don't know once you learn oh also in the packaging ah in the packaging it said not to um, um use saliva i was like wow who put saliva on their contacts it's disgusting but okay oh i'm so blind let me put my contacts on real quick so this is my eyes before Oh, and also I said I'll show you guys the contacts. So here's the honey contacts. They look honey. Let's have the look on my eyes. Honey. Those look like honey. I just hope they don't look too much like honey on my eyes and more neutral because I have really dark brown eyes. Like very dark brown eyes. Those are my eyes without contacts. So oh, that's one eye. How does it look, guys? One eye. Boom. Let me see. I'm going to put it in the light so I can show you guys. Oh, we have a visitor. I did all. I did all. This is how it looks, guys. Not too sure. I'll try. What, what What's going on? We have a guest appearance from Mondo. Anyway, guys, my cat better not jump on me. Sometimes he jumps on me. So, okay. We got one on. I'm going to go ahead and put the second one on. Wow. Wow. Oh, wow, that is so pretty. Okay, look, I kind of do like how I look in the brown eyes, but I'll just show you guys the contacts. And they're my vision, so I could see just like how I would see with my normal contacts. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do they look realistic at all? I haven't seen myself in a different eye color in so long. Oh my God, okay. But um, this is the contour scores. Honestly, if I had to rate these, if I had to rate, if I had to rate these contacts, honestly, like actually seeing them in person and like through the mirror, they look so real. Give me one second. They're definitely hazel. I would say they're more honey-ish vibes. I was trying to go for something possibly a little bit more subtle because these are like, actually, these are really nice. It takes some getting used to, but wow like they i feel like they blend in really nice with the brown eyes can you guys i didn't see that wow anyway i'm gonna go ahead and give these a 10 out of 10. i don't want to make this video too long i'm just kind of amazed that um the naturalness is like it looks very subtle my cat's destroying stuff back there oh oh my god look my good my good what are you doing Okay, guys, I don't want the video to be too long, like I said. So if you guys enjoyed this video and like to see more videos like this, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and turn your bell on for whenever I do post a new video. I do make a ton of different things, you know. I hope you guys enjoy some of my vlogs. And yes, see you guys next time. I recommend this company. So if you want to purchase from Dimple, Dimple Color. This is um Heavenly, whoops. This is the color Heavenly Hazel. And yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.